So what exactly was Tenny trying to do in that video, guys? I don't understand. Anyways, if you've got some 5,000 Naira that you're not using anymore, please just try to squeeze into Tenny's hands because she's going to need to buy some Aboni key to fix her body. And if not prayer, you feel offer to Tenny, please just offer some prayers up for her because she truly, truly needs it right now. Tenny is up and grateful and we are also up and grateful guys welcome to gusto news once again thank you so much for liking and sharing and subscribing telling your friends about what you do right here at gusto tv it's a beautiful thursday morning yes and we've got loads of news to give to you today first and foremost we've got tenny in the building yes we said it before we've also got thames we've got zlatani Bile, the world president we've got obio david himself we've got asha k himself mr money the lungu boy in the building also we've got victor osimen and the one and only apako master himself terry g is in the building as well loads and loads of news guys we'll start off with the major one which is a shake doing his thing right now in nigeria in africa in the us in the uk everywhere you go there's a name ashake the lungubo album less than two weeks old and everybody chopping it like kopiko everywhere you go right now we saw a couple of days ago fans actually singing the remember song word for word that was on you know uh the last album work of art and on the lungo you know boy album we've seen lots of people singing skating and a couple of other songs we told you before ashake actually created a couple of records on the 26 million streams on apple music in the first five days he's gotten number one record in on all the streaming you know platforms a clean sweep for Ashake on this one and everyone has been asking what next for Ashake anyways guys we told you Ashake started his world tour and was you know it's been amazing so far now the first stop was at you know the capital one arena 21,000 Ashake sold out just last night Ashake also sold out the state farm arena 16,000 over 16,000 you know capacity arena now Ashake has joined the greats, there's a list of the greats. We've got a couple of Nigerian artists, Afrobeat artists, who sold out the, uh, the State Farm Arena before now. In 2022, Bonaboy sold out the State Farm Arena. 2023, Davido sold out the State Farm Arena. 2024, Bonaboy sold out as well. And right now, they've been joined by the one and only, wait for it, Mr. Money on the list so, so right now in terms of selling out the state farm arena we've got bonaboy twice david o once and ashake right now it's amazing last night was really really good ashake performed a lot of songs for his fans he was energetic all through loads and loads of songs from the mr money with the vibes album to work of art to lungu boy we told you three albums in three years for ashake is no mean feat and that guy has done a trifecta right now killing all the shows and definitely making sure that his presence is felt even when he leaves the arena now that's one thing ashake has done it's totally sold out major major record for ashake on that one and of course he had a couple of guest appearances as well Zlatan Ibile came up on stage yet ashake introduced Zlatan Ibile on stage and it was really really good to see you could see uh, Zlatan saying what's up atl are you doing yes 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 ashake is the guy actually bringing out Zlatan Ibile. we know they have a song together bust down and it was really amazing to see ashake supporting you know his colleagues in industry as well of course we know Zlatan also went there to support ashake now the big fish was there as well david o and Ashake were backstage together, really, really vibing and all of that. And there was also Quavo of the Migos himself was also there to support Ashake right there at the State Farm Arena in ATL in Atlanta. Yes, Atlanta was on lockdown last night. The fans came through for Ashake, both the blacks and the whites and everybody came through for Ashake just yesterday and it was a night to remember for mr money we can't wait for more of the venues we can't wait for more of the sold out news from ashake because at gusto tv we love afrobeat we love ashake so much and we can tell you that mr money with the vibes is actually a confirmed longo boy doing his thing right now it's afrobeat to the world it's nigeria to the world and we can't wait for more of the ashake achievement right now yes talking about what tour 
Temps is actually on a roll at the moment as well because he just sold out all guys wait for it she sold out almost all the venues only denver and las vegas is remaining now we told you that the born in the world world tour you know started already august 22 yes started in fact it's starting today and right now thames is saying guys let it all begin i'm also set to go on water just like ashake and right now guys almost all the venues are sold out uh thames does have special guests now miss sharon and there's a guy called lacon yes who is in there as well and right now we can see a couple of places sold out there's orlando sold out dallas sold out august 26 august 28 houston sold out august uh, there's um washington as well sold out philadelphia sold out new york sold out september 7 in toronto sold out september 8 in toronto sold out as well as boston sold out montreal sold out chicago sold out De vancouver sold out city sold out san francisco sold out and los angeles in october sold out just las vegas on september 29th and denver september 17th are still open up for tickets yes so go grab your ticket right now in denver if you're in denver and if you're in las vegas right now thames still has a couple of few more tickets to go but it's amazing though it is really really amazing almost 15 venues right here and thames are sold out night almost 90 percent of them that is really really amazing guys shout out to thames born in the world war tour is going to be crazy amazing with a couple of other amazing guest artists who are going to come but guys thames breaking records right now and selling out shows selling out arenas and venues and everything this is really really good and we wish thames all the very best guys on this particular uh one now talking about achievement and all of that terry g is actually in the news for a very good reason now we know Apple master had an issue with whiskey you know the other time by releasing their song without authorization but of course uh, you linked up with the one and only nigerian striker who is being linked with monaco linked with psg linked with chelsea linked with arsenal and even manchester united right now victor Osimen. yes victor Osimen is not playing for napoli he doesn't want to play for napoli anymore and he says guys i want to leave i want to go to the premier league or to the french league on uh, right now but guys that is not even the meat of the matter right now now terry g linked up with victor simen just some days ago and just some hours ago as well the man sent terry g a major major gift which was really really amazing now that's a very kind gesture from victor simen to the one and only apaco master terry g a balenciaga yeah a balenciaga gift was what um terry g got from victor simen yes now who is getting another gift right now it is tenny getting a gift of maybe some body pain and all of those things because what exactly was tenny trying to do now in a video circulating on social media we could see uh tenny actually you know trying to recreate the popular up and grateful challenge and everything and she didn't even do it from her bed right now she did it from beside a particular lake you know outside of nigeria and everything say oh guys up and grateful up and grateful up and grateful and before you know it tenny wanted to do some back flips and some assault and everything and she landed straight on her back and i mean it wasn't a good sight to see but it was quite funny and that's why i said it earlier that if you've got some 5k that you're not using anymore please just squeeze into tenny's hand she probably will need some sort of a bony key or or some rub you know some you know some people to help out to you know straighten the bones and everything right there because now nah, that that was actually very very funny but of course uh, you know jokes aside we just want to wish uh tenny all the best we hope that she you know didn't hurt herself and all of that it was a challenge that has been going on on social media and tenny had started to just jump on that particular one quite funny but of course we know that tenny uh will be fine and should be fine as well guys that's all we have for you on this one coastal news yes guys please continue to stay safe please go like subscribe share watch our videos and tell us exactly what we need to do to be better in everything that we do a couple of more shows are coming to you guys very very soon but for now please continue to watch our videos subscribe tell your friends about what we do and most importantly stay safe out there guys stay safe out there god bless you cheers